Uh, good morning, Felipe. Thanks for joining us. Good morning. It's a pleasure to talk to you. So how does this test exactly work? Okay, so we developed a, a, a high quality point of care rapid test to detect the antibodies against the COVID-19 virus. Uh, so what makes our test special is that we used bioinformatics to, to make a test based on pro protein-based synthetic parts. So the consequences that, of that is that we got a very high quality test. Uh, so we, we validated our tests with more than 400 people and we were very happy with the result because we got almost 100% of specificity and sensitivity, which means that the chance of getting uh, an incorrect result is very low, which is, which as, as far as I know, it's, every country has problems like that, like low quality tests and we are here to solve that problem. And so the, the test can detect if you have the virus or if you had the virus. So once you, once you have the, had the virus, you have the IgG antibody, you were safe to go back to work, to, you were not spreading the disease anymore. I, I think it's interesting that uh, there, there's a test that could, I mean, you, you could learn if you did have the virus. I think that part here is interesting. What is the difference, though, between a COVID-19 test and an antibody test? The difference is that the COVID-19 test detects if you have the virus. So it's, it's just, it's just a, a, a small part of the time that you have the virus. The, the safe test virus, uh, the, the safe test test detects that if you have the antibodies against the virus or is, your, is the response from your body to the virus. So that's why you can identify if you had the virus in the past. That's, I think that's the, uh, the, that's the big deal because when we are trying to reopen the economy, that's, that's a very important information. And, and people need to, to, to rely on the test. They need to, to know what's happening to them. They need to know if they have the virus, if they are spreading the virus, or they are safe. They had the virus and they are not spreading anymore. They can get back to work. So this test still has to be approved. What are some of the hurdles there that you're dealing with? Yeah, so we have to, to fill a, a lot of papers. We, we are uh, making a lot of applications. But I think it will be, uh, we're not taking too long to, to get the, the, this approval. And we, we hope soon we will be uh, making this test available in drugstores and pharmacies all over Canada. And people can, can go to, to drugstores and, and have, have them tested. So they, they have more information to, 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 to learn how to deal with this, this new normal, right? I think it's a, it's a, it's a very a big deal to, to understand what's going on. All right, Felipe, thanks. It's a very interesting work that your company is doing. Thank you.